Yay, it's running. It's a lot quieter than the other unit ever was. The cicadas in the tree are a lot louder than it is. Got it all buttoned up. We only have one issue with the thermostat wire. It's a little too short, but I bought a new one today. And after the house gets done cooling down, we've been 24 hours without air conditioning. So we're going to go ahead and let it run for a while. But we got a new whip on the power supply that runs over. We have our hoses hooked up. Everything looks pretty good. I do want to say, I'll go inside and I'll explain it two different times. This unit has an O slash B as a wire. Our O slash B was orange and it has to do with whether the cooling or is running or the heating is running. Yesterday when we hooked it up, we thought everything was great. We hooked it all up, got ready to go, and it was blowing hot air when it was set to cool. And if you have a switch on your thermostat, you have to make sure that you switch that to the B side and not the O side, because the O side is for standard is cold, and that's what most heat pumps are. This one here is different. It's odd, and it starts up in the heat inverter version. So you have to flip the little switch on your thermostat, and we thought we had something wired wrong. So that's your problem if you've got that issue. It's a uh, either a switch manually on your thermostat or something electronically programmed. Our old one was a switch, but we switched over to a new Wi-Fi and it has a programmable O slash B switch that you flip to make sure that the heat pump is working correctly. Otherwise, it will run in reverse and you will put hot air out when it's running in a cold mode. 